Hey there YouTube and uh, today I'm going to show you how to get themes for GIMP and I will show you right now I just installed what one looks like that's probably the most popular one as you can see it's uh, not gray it's uh, this blackish uh, it's called Aurora Midnight I think it's called but um, you have all these themes you can get and here, this is only one there's probably about 25 I'll show you the program right now. Um, here's what it looks like. And yeah, it's called Aurora Midnight is what I have right now. You can get all these different uh, um, themes for GIMP. As you can see, this is the one I have right now. You just hit OK and then hit Yes. But I'm going to show you the website. And the link is in the description. And to download it, all you're going to need to do is go down a little ways and there's a big download button right here you just click it and hit uh, open or whatever comes up don't save it just run it and then um, ex uh, like it'll open it it'll save as a zip file you open it and then just double click on it double click on the GIMP themes uh, setup and it will open and you just follow the instructions that it gives you and it's just a normal installation process and that's how easy it is and then you will have different GIMPs f uh, theme themes for GIMPs but when you install it with the uh, package um, a little icon will uh, pop up on your desktop and um, just double click it and then you'll have these you'll just have this box and then it'll say theme and you can choose your theme and if you're wondering, the one I have, it's called Aurora Midnight, which I've already told you this about five times. I don't even know. Okay. But anyway, yeah. And you can choose your font. I usually use, uh, just leave it how, leave that stuff how it is, unless you want to mess with it. But, uh, anyway, when you get your, uh, theme you want, you just click OK, and then it'll say, uh, the file blah 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 will be overwritten are you sure you just say yes and it's not gonna it's not gonna hurt anything that's just um how it's just overwriting it so it'll make GIMP look like this I think it's really neat and cool I thought I'd show you guys how to do it so um thanks for watching I'll make I'll be making tutorials um as much as possible and please subscribe and add me as a friend thanks for watching